So over the years, there have been several stadium features throughout all sports that have been rendered basically obsolete. Some of them have been taken out, some of them can still be found, and in this video we'll go through a few of them. These are the stadium features that are now obsolete. First off, we have large light supports or large light posts. Going back before widespread use of white LED lights and light bulbs, most stadiums used the metal halide light bulb and lights. And these were a lot less energy efficient and took a lot more space and bulbs to light up a stadium at night. And in turn, it would require much larger spaces and supports for those lights. So what you now have on many stadiums that were built before LED lights became a thing is you have a lot of support structures that are a lot larger than what is needed for the lights since the LED is much more concentrated and requires many less bulbs which at stadiums for the most part was not until the early 2010s. Next we have ticket booths. You know basically there were so many of these in stadiums that you can't just repurpose or hide or demolish all of them unless you want to spend a ton of money. You really never see them in use anymore because everything has just gone to digital now. Even if you want to buy tickets at the stadium, you just go to a kiosk. You don't even go to a booth anymore. I mean, we're at a point where stadiums aren't even taking cash anymore, so paper tickets are pretty much done. Another feature we have are turnstiles. You know, these were used to monitor the count of people attending a game. But with digital sales, you really don't need that anymore. Everything is tracked through barcode scanning. So by and large, you won't really see too many of these much anymore. This next one is for baseball stadiums specifically, and that is outfield upper decks at stadiums. Attendance for the most part has gotten to a point where at MLB stadiums, there just isn't a demand for really much over 40,000 capacity stadiums. You have right field upper decks in Cleveland and in Denver that have been drastically reduced in capacity and most of the stadiums built in the last 15 years or so either don't have outfield upper decks or if they do they're either very small they're separated from the rest of the upper deck and at a lower height. Globe Life Field in Texas is one of the few newer stadiums that's still built an outfield upper deck but the capacity of that stadium is only just over 40,000 and those seats are lower than the highest decks. Basically, with the poorest views in a given stadium and the lower demand for tickets league-wide, there just isn't much purpose in building such sections at stadiums, unless it's for one of those few select teams that just draw very well no matter what. What has also become obsolete is the single-level upper deck that wraps around the stadium. These were pretty popular from the 90s and before, but ever since about the mid-2000s, Pretty much every stadium's upper deck is multi-level and not just a big set of rows that connect to each other all on the same deck. And lastly, I wouldn't say this is obsolete per se, but general seating definitely is a lot less popular. You have a lot more standing areas, bars, and clubs, not just in baseball, but also in the NFL to an extent, because many people just don't want to sit in a confined spot for three hours and they want to take in the experience of the stadium and move about it. So those are a few features that are obsolete or becoming obsolete. Let me know what you think and thank you for watching.